Hello dear students, now we are going to derive uh, lens makers formula which is very very important. So, we have considered a thin uh, uh, convex lens and we have considered one point object. Object is placed in uh, rarer media of refractive index N 1. Lens is the denser medium of refractive index N 2. Object distance we have taken it as u image distance we have taken it as v. Okay. So, there will be two refractions here, one is there will be refraction through a b c, here there will be some refraction, here also there will be some refraction. Okay. In the absence of this uh, curved surface, this ray will directly go here. Okay. Now, uh, we will discuss this in detail. Okay. Now, this is the original uh, picture. Okay. Now, what we will do? Let us suppose that this A D C, this surface A D C is absent. Okay. If A D C is absent, okay, if this portion here, if this is absent, then what will happen? Then uh, this ray will not suffer one more refraction, it will go here. Okay. Now, what happens? We will write in the absence of A D C. Okay. In the absence of A D C, okay. In the absence of A D C, okay. When A D C is not there, what we will do? We will use the <laughs> relation between N U V and R. So, what is that relation? N two by V minus N one by U equal to N two minus N one divided by R. So, this relation we have to use, how to remember this? Refractive index of the image medium divided by image distance minus refractive index of the object medium divided by object distance. We are using this here. Okay. When we use this, what happens here? Refractive index of image medium, okay, image is formed in N2. Okay. Refractive index of image medium divided by image distance, this image distance, what is this? V1 or V prime. Okay, V1 or V prime. Okay, minus refractive index of object medium that is N1, N1 divided by object distance. What is object distance here? Object distance is U is equal to N2 minus N1 divided by R. So, there there was there was only one radius of curvature. Here radius of curvature of this, let it be R 1. Okay. R 1, so R 1 is till here, okay. R 1, R 1. So, this is my equation number 1. Now, what we will do? In the absence of A, B, C, what is the situation? We will write, okay. One more equation. In the absence of in the absence of A, B, C. If A, B, C is absent, then what happens? Then the ray is coming here, in the, from the, in this direction the ray comes. Okay. If you extrapolate this ray back, I will not get the object. Okay. So, in this direction if I go, I will not get the object. So, then therefore, what I should do? I should extrapolate this uh, line here, so that this point, okay, this point I prime can be considered as virtual object. Okay. So, therefore, what will be the object distance? Object distance will be V1. Now, I will apply this. Okay. Refractive index of image medium, where is the image formed? Image is formed in N1. Refractive index of image medium divided by image distance, image is formed here. So, what is image distance? Image distance is V minus refractive index of object medium, where is the object? Okay. Refractive index of object medium is N 2 divided by object distance. So, we have to take virtual object distance. What is that? V 1 is equal to N 1 minus N 2, N 1 minus N 2 divided by R 2, because radius of curvature of this curved surface is R 2. Now, this is my 
equation number 2. This is equation number 2. Now, what I will do? I will simplify these two equations. When I, when I perform, okay, 1 plus 2, what happens? 1 plus 2, if I perform, what I will get? This uh, n2 by v1 plus n2 by v1 minus n2 by v1, these things, these two get cancelled, okay. I am left with n1 by v minus n1 by u, okay, I will write here, n1 by v minus n1 by u is equal to, is equal to here, n2 minus n1 by r1, okay, plus n1 minus n2 by r2. n2 minus n1 by r1, n2 minus n1 by r1 plus n1 minus n2 by r2 or I can write this as okay, n1 by v minus n1 by u is equal to n2 minus n1 by r1. Now, I will interchange this, okay, what happens? Minus n2 minus n1 by r2, what happens? n2 minus n1, this is common, here n1 is common, okay, what happens? n1 into 1 by v minus 1 by u is equal to n2 minus n1 into 1 by r1 minus 1 by r2 or I can write this as 1 by v minus 1 by u is equal to n2 minus n 1 divided by n 1, what happens? n 2 by n 1 minus 1 into 1 by r 1 minus 1 by r 2, okay. Now, I will uh, name this equation as some, okay, equation number 3, okay. Now, here what I will do? I will do one approximation. If, okay, if the object is at infinity, then the image will be formed at the focus, correct? Now, if the object is at infinity, okay if u is equal to infinity, then what will be the image distance? Image distance will be equal to f. Then what happens to this, okay? In the place of v, I should write uh, f. In the place of u, I should write infinity. So, what is 1 by infinity? 1 by infinity is 0. So, therefore, I can write 1 by f, 1 by f, so this is 1 by infinity, that is 0, I can leave, is equal to n2 by n1 minus 1 into 1 by r 1 minus 1 by r 2. This is lens makers formula, okay. This is lens makers formula. If the refractive index of uh, rarer medium is 1, then what happens? Refractive index of denser medium is n, then what can be done? 1 by f is equal to n minus 1 into 1 by r 1 minus 1 by r 2, okay. Say, I will write this. If uh, n 1 is equal to 1 and n 2 is equal to n, okay then what happens? 1 by f is equal to n minus 1 into 1 by r 1 minus 1 by r 2. So, this is lens makers formula.